So this is an retro, we'll call it retro style kind of DJ setup. And so just to show you a little bit of the setup, this is this was built by my husband, who is my tech expert and roadie. And this unit here, we had a, we've had, I think this is our third unit from when we started back in 1979 when we were both in the military, but this unit here he built, oh gosh, it's been probably 30 years ago and it's been you know, a lot of gigs since then and it works well for us. We've had to replace, I wanna say the um, mixer, I think once or twice. The turntables are, I think we've only had to replace one of the turntables, I think that one. Um, other than that, I think pretty much everything else is okay. We used to have another unit of some kind here. Oh, a cassette player we used to have in this section here that we no longer use. Um, so a lot of the equipment has followed us around for quite a few years, including, by the way, these JBL speakers. Actually, they are stage monitors or sound monitors. These speakers right here. And they've done really well for us. We've had them since 1981, I believe it was. So my husband built this setup. It does pretty well for us. And we'll have it going here in a little bit. By the way, these, these two right here are strobe lights. I'll give you a view of what I am seeing when I have this unit kind of going here we've got a couple and of course nowadays we also have to go digital so we've got a couple of iPads to help us with trying to find <laughs> there you go trying to find songs and requests um, that we may not have in our collection now we do have these, by the way, for those of you that are interested in keep getting, acquiring, and keeping old-style vinyl albums, these are just wonderful. They really take a lot of bouncing around, but they protect it's an Odyssey brand, and I got them online. They protect the music. The albums I got online are just great. They're tough, but you can actually lock them. They hold quite a bit. Um, you can use a dolly to cart things around and don't have to worry about cardboard boxes. I used to use milk crates like this, but this is much better. Keeps them out of the dust. I highly recommend uh, their use if you <clears throat> are into this sort of thing. As far as the lids, I see you I show you here, the lids actually come right off. And you can stow them away during the performance. And off you go. There's something else that the, the, these uh, kind of boxes here for my old CDs are pretty durable too. But actually, these black boxes are much better. These Odyssey boxes are much better. But anyway, that gives you an idea of. Some of the things that old-style DJs prefer and like to do.